What is going on YouTubers, Abdroid7 here from AndroidBlackspot.com right now with AT&T Galaxy Note 2 and I'm gonna show you how to flash Novella ROM on your Note 2. This does work on AT&T or any Canadian version of Note 2 and for this to happen you need to have rooted Galaxy Note 2 with custom recovery installed. Either you could have TWRP or CWM recovery installed. Now before you boot into Clockroom recovery I would recommend you guys to do a titanium backup which where you can always restore all your applications so you don't have to download it from the market but do not restore data just do backup and restore only applications now to boot into this recovery or TWRP recovery there are a couple of ways you get extended power menu if you if you know what that is you could always boot in from that if you don't know don't worry about it go ahead and go to play store download an application called quick boot and from that application it requires super user permission or super su and you need to just press reboot recovery and you'll be right here once you're right here go ahead and press backup and restore oops and go ahead and back back your from up because if something goes wrong you can always restore that i already backed up so i'm not gonna do that after that we are going to wipe data factory reset so delete all the user applications and all the user settings everything do not worry this not gonna delete your internal SD card it means you're not gonna see your photos or music go away all your system is gonna go away it means all your setting logins and application will go away after that we are going to wipe cache press yes and I will wipe cache and you can see all the whatever is happening right here and now we are going to go ahead and go to install Z from SD card choose z from sd card go to download folder if it's not there you can go ahead and go down and select your file i think i have it in my external sd card which i cannot access so i will be back with the rom but you go ahead and find the rom and go to in the folder Hey guys, so I finally got those files transferred into my internal SD card. I originally downloaded it into my external SD card and clearly you see Clockoma recovery does not support external SD card. So I will have to go ahead and go get TWRP. I think I've done a video on it. If I don't, I will do it soon. But if I have done a video on it, you can click where it says Clockoma recovery and flash TWRP recovery. And let's go ahead and wipe data again since I restored it. So I'm going to wipe data factory reset once more and uh, wipe cache here again. I always used to do this twice, but since the news recovery are, has been improved, I don't do it anymore. But then you can go and install SZ from SD card and go to internal and go to download. That's where I have mine. So you're going to select Novella Beta ROM, which is part of alliance rom family and where it says one it's the first upload first of all you're gonna flash this one so hit yes this rom has themed uh system ui plus uh, phone ui and everything phone ui means phone application user interface system ui means uh, the pull down menu other features include custom setting which has a lot of different features but if i give out not gonna watch my review on it so please go ahead and stay tuned for the review and until this is done let's go ahead and watch what it's doing see if you can see right there it's installing the update as of now this will take quite quite a while because it's about 700 or 800 megabytes as i said before it's full stock rom and stock rom is always big for the note it was initially big for note one and now note two which combines multi windows and other things that note one didn't have and this is again jb for that one that one if i if I'm 100% correct, but we will have to look into about phone to find out. I'll be back once the process bar. Oh, it's already going, so I thought it's gonna take more. Then again, you're gonna go back, choose 
zip from SD card you're gonna go back to download and uh, just wanna do the update too I'm gonna go back install the kernel that I like I do not like no two core sometimes you lose your IMEI number so do not I don't recommend those two I recommend cyber kernel or however you want to say it I will have a link in the description for that too so go back reboot system let's me let me zoom out And since it's first initial boot, it will take time because you know the system needs to settle down rather than you just rebooting your phone. This is the new boot animation. You could see Alliance Galaxy Note 2. It has a nice kind of 001 or some pattern going on. If you could see it down there. and there is the shot of boot animation this rom comes with now there are a lot of customization in this rom i say because the stock rom mostly don't have a lot of custom menus or settings for but this rom does come with a lot and uh, it's in beta because the theme has not been finished everything runs as far as camera wi-fi and everything goes and this is just my how-to video i'm going to take time and see how the battery lab does about a day 24 hours of usage and i will give you my initial review on the rom so once the phone boots up we are going to be letting it sit for five minutes or so i say five but three four minutes will do it if you let it sit it really helps the phone and the system and you don't get as much as lag when using then you want to reboot the phone and use it that's how the developer recommend when I'm in hurry I tend to bend that rule and just go as soon as as that now if you don't want Samsung account you can just skip that between if you had signed up when they were offering you could have gotten a case free from Samsung I have a video on it I don't know when I'm gonna add it and post it but as far as uh, this one goes it's done there is no setup it has a cool wallpaper as you if you could i don't know if you like it or not but it has cool wallpaper and this is what it comes with these are the applications and stuff you know why am i showing you this there is a full review coming out so subscribe and thank you for watching guys